Hey Chelsea, it's October 25th and you, you still somehow failed to make a video yesterday? Chelsea, if I can make time, you can make time. So I came home this weekend and even though I didn't get to see you for various reasons, and I really wish we could have met up, but you know, life happens. I'm going to tell you how that went. There was a group of six of us. We went to the mall where we went to Hot Topic, where I finally got my Gryffindor tie for my Hermione Granger costume. It's gonna be awesome. After the mall, we went to Woodward Park. They've never seen so many squirrels in such a short amount of time. It was fantastic. And we climbed trees, which I successfully did for the first time. I'm incredibly impressed with myself. You should know that I'm usually extremely ungainly and uncoordinated, which is ironic seeing that I've been playing sports all my life and I'm at least okay. I don't know. On our way to Minchie's after dinner, it started downpouring and then we had to sprint to the cars and then get in drive across town, sprint back and sprint in the Minchies so we wouldn't get soaked. Then we went across the parking lot to Bards and Noble, where many of us practically lusted over leather-bound editions of classic books for a good hour. Needless to say, it was pretty much nuts. And now that that update is over, I've had a suggestion from, from this lovely individual here that um, I should talk about my best birthday. Well, for most people's 18th birthdays, you know, and in buying a lottery ticket and doing other milestone activities and such. But for my 18th birthday, I actually went with a group of friends to a swing dancing club. <laughs> and let me tell you, it was fantastic. You should try swing dancing, everyone. Except there was this really creepy 50-something-year-old guy that smelled like cheap cologne and creep that was hitting on all the younger women. It was interesting. That one was definitely my favorite. Well, hopefully that little random suggestion has spiced things up a little bit, made things a little bit more interesting around here on my part. I expect to see you tomorrow. So, see you tomorrow, Chelsea.